Hey, good morning, folks, and welcome again to another exciting episode of Friday with Fran, the Real Estate Man, and we are opening day today. I even have my hot dog tie on, but we're celebrating this, not the uh, font, but the uh, real Ariel, uh, on National Mermaid Day. And uh, this is a great one when you're uh, having uh, dinner on Sunday, a little joke. What did the, uh, or where did the fishermen and the mermaid meet? Ha! <laughs> Online! How apropos. But anyway, enough about mermaids and fictitious things. Um, you're hearing a lot of stuff about real estate in the, in the news, and I just want to say, hey, everybody, be calm, turkey lurkey. Everything really was taken care of uh, back here in Pennsylvania in 1999. Uh, that's when we had the Real Estate Licensing Act, uh, that took effect in November and we remember we were all running around worried about this. Why 2K? Well, that didn't really happen. So uh, everybody should just sit tight. Uh, there might be a few changes, but uh, nothing in the ruling has really changed. Um, so what do we talk about? We talk about buyer agency contract in PA. Well, it is what it is. A buyer signs a contract uh, with an agent and that agent will represent them. They'll negotiate uh, confident, maintain confidentiality, and compensation is typically paid by the seller but is negotiable. And on the flip side, seller agency or the listing contract represents the seller's interest. Same thing, helping list property, uh, negotiate, facilitate, uh, has fiduciary duties to the seller as well. But again, commission is agreed upon in a listing agreement uh, paid by the sellers at uh, closing and that is also uh, negotiated. So there's a buyer's contract and there's a seller's contract and that's what's really makes our state uh, really kind of uh, maybe even immune to a lot of this. Uh, we were pretty smart over 20 years ago to know that a seller's agent couldn't represent a buyer and a buyer's agent couldn't represent a seller and therefore the agreements were changed and even the agreement of sale. So. Um, Anyway, if you have any questions, kind of give me a ring. Uh, a lot of f news out there is kind of giving you uh, some uh, maybe uh, miss news, if you will. Um, but anyway, this Saturday, this Sunday, uh, I have some of our uh, agents here in the office. They are sitting open houses at my new listing at 328 Knoll Road in Plymouth Meeting. Um, so if you get a chance, uh, pop by. Uh, you can see uh, online, you can either go to my website or any of the other real estate websites, uh, the actual times will be in there. So anyway, uh, take care. Thanks again uh, for watching another exciting episode of Friday with Fran. Hey, if you celebrate Easter, happy Easter. Take care and we'll see you next week.